Hey, hey, everybody, this is Larry. This is day 19, I think. Oh, no, 18, 18. Day 18 of the Lego Day Challenge. Hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, join me on Discord. Let me know what you think about today's farm. Uh, no drone need today. Maybe I'll do something in New York or something. Just, you know. Uh, let me know in the comments if you want to see more of uh, random Larry in random places, uh, even not drones ones. Uh, but yeah, today's farm is. 1615 maximal network rank uh let's see there's a there's end cities there's some roads connecting them it doesn't have to be a tree it looks like sometimes it happens that is i don't know it's a tree all right the, the network rank of two different cities is defined by a total number of directly connected directly connected roads to either city if a road is directly connected to both cities it's only counted once okay a maximal network rank of the infrastructure is the maximum network rank of all pairs of different city. Uh, man, this is a lot of things to say. Let's take a look at an example, I guess. They're just going to try to return this thing. Okay, so 0 and 1 is 4. Is there four roads that are connected to either 0 and 1? Uh, the first thing I wanted to do is just look at N. And, uh, uh, and to be honest, once I, I see N, I could stop thinking, right? Because N is 100... And that means that um, that means that you can do an n square algorithm, which I guess kind of makes sense in either case, um, because even though I said that, yeah, I mean it's n square, but uh, looking at it again, to be honest, is that roads is um, yeah you're given the roads as as an input, and as an input that is basically the length of roads, it's y right, y being the number of edges. Uh, and the number of edges, I mean, the algorithm that I had in my head was going to be linear in the size of the number of edges anyway. So it's going to be linear in that case because you can't do faster than the number of, like, you have to read the edges. Um, like, you have to read every edge to, to be able to kind of figure this out, I believe. I mean, I don't know. So that is the lower bound of the prime anyway. So as soon as I have that, I'm fine. I am happy. And we can kind of keep going. Brute force, right? So what are we brute forcing? Just for each, every pair of nodes, um, we can brute force it. Uh, and in this case, uh, the node like... Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. I was just looking. I was just kind of checking if they're like self-edges or multiple edges. Um, because I think that's the only thing that could... I mean... Even then, it's fine. It's just more if statements, right? Depending on how they want to define it. But um, but now we don't even have to do that. Because basically, it's just a degree. Degree is a fancy graph way of saying the number of edges connected to a node. And so it is just literally the number of edges connected to uh, node 0 and node 1. And then if they have an edge, then you know that you double count it, so you just subtract 1. And then you just take the max of all these pairs, and that should be it. Um, there are a couple of ways you can kind of do this, of course. Uh, and you, there are a lot of different ways you can implement it. For sh I mean, it's just a different ways of writing for loops. Um, so yeah, so I, let, let, so let's do it. Uh, yeah, maybe I'll write something like degrees is equal to zero times uh, n. I like big n's. I don't know. Just kind of used to it, I suppose. Um, but yeah, uh, and then yeah, just for you, for v in roads, right? Uh, degrees of u increment, Oops. and we, we uh, degrees of v goes up by one. And then now, to, you know, you can do some. You can do either way you, you want, which is you know something like this for i, you know, for every pair of i and j. Um, the way that I'm going to do it maybe is a little bit different just because I think this is slightly more optimal, but it's really not a big, uh, always minimum, right? Whoops. Or well, maximum, so this should be. Uh, but yeah, this is slightly more optimal for the reason that it is a, is a hard input, linear input versus maybe the other thing, which is just to go over four votes again. Um, and then, you know, best is equal to max, best, uh, degrees of u, ooh, u, Plus degrees of v minus one to because this road is double counting, and that should be good. Unless I misunderstood the problem, which is possible. Uh, hmm. I mean, I didn't. Hmm. I didn't assume that they're connected. Did I misunderstand something? Oh, oh, I see. Uh, I guess, yeah, okay. 
Okay, wow, I am being silly. Yeah, yeah I mean, this is probably good, but I, but I guess the, the best answer doesn't have to be, uh, you know, for you, we, and Rhodes. So, yeah, okay, so yeah, you have to do the other thing then. Uh, huh. Because basically the idea here is that... Um, is that they don't have to be connected or they're connected but they don't have to be an edge betweening them right so then now we have to do something like uh mm, yeah, like something like ij in roads but we want to do it in more linear time so that's why i kind of wanted to do it in a more funky way but okay fine right so we have a uh, road set is equal to a set and then you can maybe do like you know road set uh, dot add uh, someone normalizing this and ooh. right and then here you know that i is smaller so if this is in votes then this is this minus one else uh, you can just take the degree of them I suppose yeah I think there's probably like a smarter way of doing this as well. Uh, maybe I misunderstood. Hmm. Dun, dun, dun. What am I doing wrong? Wow, today is not... Am I taking shortcuts or something? What is the... Uh, zero, one? Uh. Okay, so zero is degree two. One is degree three. Huh, what am I doing? What am I doing? Uh, sorry, friends. I don't know. Wow. Maybe I'm going too fast. But now I'm just confused. But this is why you test things, I suppose. Uh, okay. Oh, 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 yeah. Okay. I, I was using the wrong thing because I didn't... I don't know. I, added, I, I think I didn't finish typing it and I forgot. All right, all right, this should be good now then. I mean, the idea is right, but man, the coding is wrong. And also, because this is, uh, 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 yeah, and this would have been like timeout anyway, even if it, you know, so that's a little bit sad. Um, but yeah, huh, much faster than last time. What did I do last time? That's so slow. Oh, huh, huh. Uh, I made it N cube instead. I guess that, that, that would be how you make it slower. But yeah, um... This is linear time, linear space. Um, yeah, we plus e if you want to be more precise, because uh, this is the v space, this is the e space, and of course this is all of e. Um, oh, oh, I just meant the space, right? Did I? I didn't say v plus e time, right? Because that would be a little bit wrong. Uh, this is actually v square plus e time uh, for you know obvious reasons. This is all of v square. Um, and yeah, and this is all of one, but that should be okay. Uh, and this is all of ye, ye time and space. So yeah, um, man, it, it's, I think, uh, the lesson for this one, for me anyway, you, you can agree or you can not agree, um, is to not take shortcuts, I think, or, or not, not, not shortcuts in like a way that like I'm trying to scam things or whatever. It's just, um, I think I did a premature optimization um going to what i did with the roads because i was like oh yeah there's this thing but but then i forgot uh in doing so i basically was optimizing for this part but then basically literally give up on all these things right and there are ways you can kind of make sure like if you really really wanted to um because i think you can reduce this to re plus e time um I mean, the way that we did is re squares time uh re square plus e time uh which for n is equal to 100 um it's gonna be fine and in the in the worst cases uh v square is gonna be ye anyway but at least for big ye right so if ye is small then then v square plus ye is not that uh ideal uh, but you can definitely do stuff with v plus ye time um the idea behind that is with connected components um <clears throat> oh is it connected components maybe not um, I mean, eh. hmm. 
Maybe I'm lying still. Yeah, it's not different components. Can you do it any time? Hmm. I don't know. Now that I think about it. That that is an interesting problem, isn't it, then? Can you do this in O of V plus Y? Hmm. We each know. I mean, I, mm, Yeah, I don't know. I mean, I, I, I could kind of think of a relog, uh, relog V1. Maybe. But yeah, I don't know. Maybe you can, maybe you can. I, I'm not sure. I don't really have one off my head, to be honest. Uh, may, maybe maybe this would tell us. Okay, blah, blah, blah. Doo, 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 doo. Yeah, that's not... I mean, this is basically what we did. Uh, sure. But yeah, I mean, this is the simple answer. But yeah, maybe there isn't. Oh, wait, there is a oh, V plus G solution. Let's see. Oh, okay, yeah. Mm. Actually, I don't know that that's. Mm. That, that, that was kind of how I was trying to think about the relog ye or relog v one sorry with with some sort of sorting and I see that the idea there is to just take like the keep track of the second best answer type thing um I don't know maybe yeah maybe there's a thing about like walking uh walking the um like almost like a walking, the 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 answer solution one. Uh, I have to think about it a little bit more though. I mean, I think that makes sense conceptually, because your answer is gonna always be. Because there are only a, really a few cases. Right, because basically you're lo looking at the max degree, and either so your answer is either. I see, I see. I mean, I guess so. I guess there's like some uh, maybe pigeonhole e thing where basically, let's say you are able to... Um, I mean, you could use like a counting sort to get the the the, um, the nodes with max degree or max degree minus one. And then you kind of... I don't know. I mean, I I can see it. I don't I don't know if I, I can prove it off my or you know like I, I have to kind of think it through a little bit more. I don't know, but it is an interesting problem, I suppose, and something to kind of think about. Uh cool. That's all I have for this one. Let me know what you think. Uh, <laughs> stay good, stay healthy, take good mental health. I'll see y'all later. And take care. Bye bye.